not coming. What happened? They're my famous sugar cookies. I baked them for the poor during Christmas time, but I whipped up a special batch just for you. I wanted to say how sorry I was for what I said. <laughs> Don't be. You were right. You know, the truth is, Rachel, if you weren't so hard on me, I never would have had the guts to start acapellas. But we need you, Mr. Shu. You've missed six rehearsals in the past couple of weeks, and when you're there, you're not really there. Which is why I think you should go ahead and hire Montana. Dakota. Whatever. You know, I'll still be there to help you guys sing and stuff, but uh, I just don't have time for all of it anymore. Of course he doesn't want anything to do with this after you kicked him in the nads. Then why did he thank me? The goal is to win. And now that Mr. Schuster has agreed to let us hire Dakota Stanley, we can. But he doesn't want us to. He just doesn't have the confidence to coach us anymore. You guys are real sensitive when it comes to this kind of stuff. And that's my fault? You see anyone else in you with a plate of I'm sorry cookies? I don't. Just you. I'm bored. All those in favor of hiring Dakota Stanley? Hey, wait up. You can't do this to Mr. Schuster. What? Make him a hero? Once we hire Dakota and win nationals, he'll thank me for it. You heard Santana. It's all about winning. Since when? Look, you have your popular clique and your football and your cliche of a blonde girlfriend. Glee is my one shot. If this doesn't work out, then my whole high school life will be nothing but an embarrassment. What's the cliche? Is that a bad thing? Wait, 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 wait. Is this one of those chick things where you're pissed about one thing, but you're just pretending like you're pissed about something else? Because... I don't know what you're talking about. Well, for a while there, you were kind of all over me, and now you just yell at me all the time. It makes me think that you're still upset about what happened in the auditorium. I'm not. I've moved on, and I'm focusing on my career now. Do you want to talk about it? No, neither do you. It's kind of ironic how you're Mr. Popular, and I'm just this nobody that everybody makes fun of. But I have enough confidence to say out loud that what happened between us in the auditorium was real. You have feelings for me, and you just don't have the guts to admit it. We're hiring Dakota Stanley. Even if it means me quitting? Yes.